I love it. I love it. It's so beautiful here. Your foliage, trees, the smell of your air, your, the food. It's fresh. Mm -hmm. Tastes very good. I love it. Oh, come on. ファンフォーデ、えっと、すごく今のところ楽しんでます。本当に街並みも綺麗ですし、え、ご飯も美味しい。ご飯が美味しいんで、なので、皆さん楽しんでください。ありがとう。ちょっと美味しい。はい。
けにっていうのは美味しい自分のこと美味しいそう、uh, I'm really humble, so I really just I, I never think about myself like that. Like, oh, this is better for me because this has got so much attention around it. And I'm like, I'm usually the one trying not to get attention <laughs> and just,、uh, um, you know, just, just trying to hang out. But I mean, there's nothing I like more than an upset.、Um, I like to derail hype trains. I like to just. まあ、素晴らしいことだとは思いますけれども私は本来、えっと、どちらかというと謙虚なタイプだと思うので仕事度が高いからやったとかそういうふうにはあまり思いませんどっちかというと普段はあまり目立たないようにっていうふうにするタイプなのでただあのそういう中でしっかりとあの勝つっていうのは重要だと思うのできちんしっかりとあの練習してるというか踊りるとい言ってましたけど。あのマチュアの戦績が40戦以上多分あると思うんですけどあのあのあのあのあのあのあのあのあのあのあのあのあのあのあのあのあの黒星がかなり多いと思うんですがその中でそれでも続けられたのはやっぱり MMA が好きだからとかそういう意地を見せたいという気持ちもありますか Absolutely.、Um, if anything, I have learned more and grew more as a fighter from my losses than I have, you know, my winnings, you know.、Um, my losses reflect I took r i s k I fought out of my comfort zone. I have,、uh, you know, not played it safe. And,、uh, you know, you just you learn from your losses, you recoup, you work harder, and you come back. まさにその通りですね。あとはもう、えー、と負けた試合から学ぶというところが多くて、えー、と負けた試合というのはつまりリスクを取って、えー、と勝ちに来たっていう結果ですので、えー、とそういったあの自分の殻を破って負けたという試合からはより学ぶものも大きいですでそこから、えー、そのまた、えー、反発しようという気持ちも生まれてそれが、えー、継続につながっていますじゃあ MMA に対するラブに関しては心中よりも。I can't honestly answer that question because who am I to say how much she loves the sport or what her reasons i s They differ from mine. But,、uh, you know, a love for the sport s a love for the sport. I really don't.、Uh, it's not something that is measured because it is felt in a feeling unique to your own. One more,、uh, one more uh, first time in Japan. Welcome to this amazing country.、Uh, tell us about you know, Rising is a big event, mass event.、Uh, what's your feelings about this opportunity to you to show your skills? You know, you face another opponent,、uh, both girls coming to make a, a professional MMA debut, but I think this is not only about the fight, but 
uh, you and Shinju can introduce uh, herself. Uh, uh, you have opportunity to uh, to show a little bit you more in the big audience in Japan, also internationally. Rising always still looking for uh, another people uh, from Europe, from uh, America. It's I think in you, for you and uh, your team and how. how much people are still involved it's a great opportunity and what is your feelings about that that uh, experience i think you try to Sorry. live in a lot right right it's a translation please uh, uh, um, it's absolutely surreal. Um, when I first started watching fighting, watching Pride being one of the first uh, fighting organizations that I would watch on video set, um, I would always just, I'd want to go fight and, and go fight in Japan. And uh, it's it's the purest form of unarmed combat that I believe that is in the world. Um, you know, some people have certain goals of fighting for other certain promotions. You know, I won't name, but mine has always been rising in Japan. Um, I'm very competitive, and uh, a lot of other places will restrict you on certain rules and cer certain things that you know you are allowed to do. And uh, here is it's just it's it's just it's it's pure it's pure it's pure it's it's the best fighting organization that I believe is in the world and uh, it's always been a dream of mine and for somebody like me to uh, you know be able to have the opportunity to come to Japan and fight for a promotion like Ryzen is just um, I'm absolutely absolutely humbled you know. Um, 